And that breaking news happening now is in South Omaha. A hit and run crash near 24th and Woolworth, and we have just learned a victim in that crash has died tonight. Reporter Nick Starling is live at the scene right now where we understand Nick, a car involved in this crash ended up in a building. That's right, Kevin. P Omaha police are still searching for the two suspects in that deadly hit and run. As you just mentioned, the 18 year old motorcyclist just pronounced dead moments ago. I'll get out of the way so you can kind of see the scene here on 24th and Woolworth. We do know the suspect vehicle was heading south on 24th Street when it veered off and hit a motorcyclist heading north. The 18 year old victim was rushed to the hospital with life saving measures like CPR, but he was just pronounced dead just moments ago. Police say the suspect is a male in his late 20s with a girl. They fled on foot and police apparently said he was giving standbyers threats as he was leaving the scene. His vehicle, uh, as you probably can see, maybe in the background right there. The airbags are deployed. Uh, we don't know the status of the suspect in terms of how healthy he is, if he was bleeding at all. But uh, Omaha police uh, do say that the two suspects fled on foot and they have leads that they are right now at the Jackson Towers. They are working with uh, housing authority to try to figure out where they are at this moment. But uh, there's many police officers involved and the helicopter are out searching for the two suspects. Yeah, um, there's evidence that while that possible alcohol use um, speed we'll be looking at is also a factor in this crash. Now this is a developing story. If we have any more updates, we will break in and newscast and give you them. Reporting live at 24th and Woolworth, Nick Starling, KMTV Action 3 News.